You guys did good. Jay, go get the bag. I don't like this. We should be in there with Naya. No, Naya said we stay out here and take care of anybody that comes out. What did you do that for? Oh. Oh. Don't even think about it! Is there somebody in that car over there? Let's check it out. client that called me. Madam Mystique can tell you this. If you go to shake his hand and he refuse, it's a very good sign. I'm gonna need to know a little bit more than that. It's going to cost you double the regular fee. Oh, that's a lot. You know where the door is.
slips my mind. Mary, sit down, please. So you got something for me? Yes. This, my friend, is what we're after. I need you and your crew to take this from this location tomorrow. You're kidding me. I'm not taking silverware. This silverware to the right customer is priceless. And I know a buyer. I've been tracking this merchandise for a while now, and this is what I'm willing to pay. That's a lot of zeros. If I do this, I don't want any cash. I don't want a half up front. I'll give you half, but I'll give you a quarter right now, and the rest when the job is done. So if this is so important to you, then half won't be a problem. You strike a hard bargain, but very well. Half it is. Alright, so tell me what you know about the facility. Here's what I know. The safe is in the second floor, in a small room. There are two main alarms. One is downstairs, and the second is on the second floor. Here's an envelope to show you the information about the job. Good. You got the make and model of the safe, the alarm system, and the floor plan of the warehouse. How'd you get these? Like I said, I was tracking this merchandise for a while. And this particular merchandise moves out of this facility after Labor Day, so it needs to be done soon. Consider it done. We'll hit it on Labor Day. Good. No one should be there. All the employees for that facility should be off. Oh. If you decide to screw me over, you'll have to answer to my associate. No, I got that under control, man. I got that. Yeah. Yeah, look, man. Let me let you go. I don't know. It's a horrible place to look at. Yeah. Man, he's outside right now. Oh, Jesus. I think he's coming out. Something you don't know about me, I can read lips. I saw what you were saying on the phone. If the city's coming around here, you best believe you're gonna cut that grass before they hit this spot. I'm not getting in trouble. We're gonna handle this later.
Oh, hello, sir. All tests and all? That's great news. Sir, when can I get back to my unit? You don't know how much this means to me, sir. Thank you. I look forward to the follow-up. Thank you, sir. All right, boys, this should be easy. You know, if this safe is where I think it is, this should really be a walk in the park. So what do you know about it? Well, it looks like an old antique Concordian. English there. Well, these old antique safes, um, th they, they all commonly have two they have three digits, well, three numbers, but the first two numbers is usually 25 and 50. And all I have to do is figure out the third number. So how long do you need to correct it? Uh, 30 minutes to an hour. Did you do your homework last night? All taken care of. Two alarm system won't be a problem. I already figured out the code. Very good. Thanks, boss. Ace is coming. All right, the box pick, guys. What you got there? Your sewing kit? You got some scissors? Oh, oh you, you trying to be funny? Is that, that's funny? Oh, so you're a lock picker now? You think I don't know what I'm doing here? Oh man, what the hell was that? That's burning laser. It's a new system that I've developed at picking locks. It's one of the fastest in the world, and I guarantee it. I know what I'm doing, man. Do you? Yeah, well, I know what else you're doing. You're going to help me carry one of my bags for me. Well, you got a, a body in that bag? Not yet. Because that's what I do. Okay. I carry bags with bodies in them. Good for you. Do you want a cookie? Both of you shut up. Get in the car. Whatever. All right, say you're up. Come on, man. Cut the show. All right, boys. Let me show you how it's done. Oh. Take a plan. I hope the rest of the doors don't take you this long.
Come on, quit playing, you little wiener. Whatever. Alright, look, he's ready. He's waving us in. Alright, boys, let's make some money. Now that's a torch. Whatever. Hi, Vanessa, I love you. See you later, man. Yeah. Yeah, did you guys take your mom I think maybe you did. Okay. I'll check it out. It's got the year mark right here. It's a 1932 model. I can't just go by the clips. But you got this, right? I can open it. There's a thin spot on this side I can cut up a cutting torch. What do they call you Daryl? Short for Daryl.
on this side. I can cut a hole in it, big enough to get my hand inside, and pull a lever and it'll unlock from the inside. This is important to me, so uh, yeah. I didn't get that, right? Whatever. It's kind of heavy. Here. Uh, 
a cleaning guy in the hallway. What guy? He's a guy in the hallway. Yeah, I think he's a janitor. It's, he's not. He's a security guard. No, he had a mop bucket. He had a mop. That guy's a janitor. He knows how to fight. He can fight. Can you do this to you guys? We, yeah, well, here's his wallet, his keys, his phone. That's all we got from him. Yeah. This guy's special forces. Where is he? Get that safe open. Oh, he was just here! He's right here. This is where we put him. You two jokers find him now. Well, what do you want us to do when we do find him? Okay. I understand. Hey, Gator. Hey. Hey, how you doing? I'm all right. Hey, check it out. I got that Concordance safe. No, it's a 1932 model. Yeah, I can't go by the clicks. Look, I started cutting my hole in the side of it. Okay. How long is it going to take for those dial pins to cool down and shrink back to normal so I can pull that lever? Yeah, that's what I thought. All right. Hey, check it out. We got a situation here. There wasn't supposed to be anybody in this building. Ace and Say caught a guy, some kind of security janitor, special forces, whatever. No, I don't know. I don't know, but he's pretty tough. They beat the daylights out of Ace and Say. It's pretty bad. Look, Say was acting like he saw a ghost, and Ace was holding his face with a sham wow. Look, I don't I don't care who he is. Look, hey. If it's Steven Seagal, I want to get an autograph before they kill him. <laughs> hey, yeah. <laughs> hey, bank on it, pal. <laughs> no, man, it's Steven Seagal. Haven't you ever seen that movie with the submarine with the... Never mind, I gotta go. All right, bye. Do you see this? Yeah, it's a gun. Yeah, it is. This is stupid. I think we should split it up. We'll cover more grounds that way. Hey, Oz want us to check in every 10 minutes. All right? Yeah. You you go that way, I right. go this way. All right. Hey. You should hide your phone in your socks. What? This is the stupidest idea I've ever heard. All right. Fine. Happy? Mm-hmm. Never question me.
Say he's checking in. I need to go look for him. Keep okay. on that safe. All right. Tell me I know how to mark it. What happened? Ace went after the guy downstairs. Did you ever get a hold of Say? Say's dead. No way. Put everything on the back burner. We gotta go after this guy. Ah! 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 
Where's my necklace? my guys off was a big mistake. <laughs> so funny. <laughs> you trained him. <laughs> Ah! <laughs> Too easy! 
You know what? <clears throat> you took out my guys. I'm gonna take out your girl. I'm gonna let you live. I'll let you live to see her die. No! Vanessa! No! The team failed, sir. Easy, sir. Find me another team. You recommending them? Find me another team. No, no, no. I just, I left a message. I couldn't contact Polo. So I left a message, yeah. I just got out of body combat class. Well, I had to, I've been coughing a lot, so it was a little bit difficult, but other than that, it's fine. Uh huh? Yeah? Alright, another week. I should be better. Alright, bye. Bet you're wondering what you did to deserve this. <laughs> Let me do my bad guy monologue. You missed the call, by the way. You're here because your boy took a lot of my money, a lot of my time, and three of my best guys. No homo, but I really like those guys. Now, just to get even, I'm gonna take time out of my schedule to kill you. Let's get this over with. Maybe this won't be a waste of my time. Now that you have seen your future through Madame Mystique's eyes, tell me, what are you going to do? I'm still going to do it. I'm just going to do it a little bit different.